Summer from Mandy News, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Y2. I'm Purple Rodri. Last time we defeated Mr. Tin City's gym leader Skyla and obtained the Jet Badge. In today's episode, we are going to make our way northwards because we're going to be looking for Professor Juniper, who has gone ahead and gotten herself in some trouble. We're actually headed towards the Celestial Tower. I sort of remember where it's located. You know, those two years of in game time haven't made me forget all of my uh, good memories and. Uh, Fantastic times we had in this region, so I'm hoping that I, th I I'm going the right way. I think it's in here. Yes, the Celestial Tower says it's a place of rest for innocent spirits. Let's head inside then, guys, and pay our respects to those duly departed Pokemon. Celestial Tower, it's a giant memorial. I wonder if this building was built in a place with many ghosts and psychic-type Pokemon, or if those Pokemon gathered here because it was built. Oh, right. How are things with Skyla? Oh, my. You want the jet badge? Well, the plane should be ready to fly then. Thanks for coming to get me. Take this as thanks. Try using it. Sweet. We just obtained the lucky egg. And if I'm correct, the lucky egg is going to give us some extra experience, which I know we'll definitely need. Okay. I'll be waiting for you in Mistleton City. All right, guys. So she was talking about a plane ride. And now here's some of those differences, I believe, from black one and white two and all those changes is that there's a lot of different areas today. And from the suggestions you guys gave me, it seems like we're going to be headed to one of those, and it's kind of exciting because it's one of those areas that I have never explored. You know, it's going to be fun. Uh, I'm guessing it's going to be very, very challenging, but I'm always up for a good challenge. You guys know me. I love getting myself into trouble and uh, having a good time and seeing how it goes. If I'm correct, they're inside of here because it looks like this is where the pilot's tower is. And, woo, there is a, there's a lot of people in here. How are you guys doing in here? How, yo, what's up, dude? Well, no, we don't have an ace pilot medal. Uh, let's talk to Skyla then. Looks like the professor's reached the stopping point in her investigation. Ready to hop aboard my plane? Sure. He ready for takeoff. You know what? I don't trust this crazy woman, uh, you know, to conduct this airplane. Okay, Skyla, we're ready. Please take us to Lentimus Town. What? You guys, wait, 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 I want to fly too. I want to do some research in Reversal Mountain. Bianca, you're here. You're starting to show the dedication of a serious researcher these days. Okay, everyone, off we go to Lentimus Town. <laughs> looks like everyone's here. Finally, it's time to fly the universe skies. Sweet, guys. It looks like we're going to be going for a little bit of a plane ride with three crazy women. If three crazy women, you know, another one of those uh, Rodri tips of the day. If three crazy women tell you get on a plane with them, you better have a parachute ready. Because uh, three women up in the skies, they're probably going to be arguing quite a bit. Just, just a tip. You're going you're gonna to want to dive out of there as soon as you can. We have made it to Lentimus Town. Hope I'm pronouncing that right. Well, I suppose I should tell you why I brought you out here. Sharon told me a group of people calling themselves Team Plasma are planning to use legendary Pokemon to take over the Unova region. As you may know, in the Unova region, there are two legendary Dragon-type Pokemon, Reshiram and Zekrom. But two years ago, Reshiram and Zekrom each recognized a trainer as a hero. They are following those trainers, so Team Plasma shouldn't be able to use the Dragon-type Pokemon. That's true! What could they be planning?! There is much we don't know about Rusher on Zekrom. That's why I want to hear what Opelucid City's gym leader, Drayden, has to say about this. He's a Dragon-type gym leader, so you might know. So we're finally to the reason why I brought you here. I want you to go to Opelucid City and hear what Drayden has to say. And I would also like you to help me if something happens. Sure, no problem. So as you can see, it seems like our mission is to find Drayden and to assist both Bianca and Professor Juniper. Now, for some reason, we have to head towards a certain mountain. Uh, but it's kind of cool. We made it to a new area. And now before we go any further here into Reversal Mountain, I'm going to show you guys the level ups. Aza hit level 37, and I trained Aza to 37 so we could learn the move Psychic, which I know is going to help us quite a bit. Acero is 36, Barky's 36, Nagini's 35, Nadar is 34, Mirth is caught up, guys, and at level 34, uh, I'm also going to go ahead and give Mirth the XP share. Uh, it seems like a lot of our Pokemon are actually close to the same level, so... Let's hope that, you know, they can all put some work in. I don't know what level the Pokemon coming up are, but we're going to give this a shot, guys. And uh, let's see how it goes. Let's proceed into Reversal Mountain then. Uh, oh, 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 bikers. I, I don't want to deal with bikers today. I don't like bike mother fudge. Here we go. And look, guys, it looks like Mirth is evolving already. So fantastic. Mirth is going to get an evolution today, which is great. So by all means, Mirth, do your work. I'm excited for you to be evolving. <laughs> we just got Mirth, 
and Merce already evolving. That's what happens when you have to catch your Pokemon and then level them up very quickly. But that's great. I'm actually very excited to get Mirth on the evolution chain. And with that, congratulations, our Mirth evolved into Vibrava. So there we have it, guys. And Vibrava is going to learn its first Dragon-type move as well. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of Bulldoze. We do have Dig now. So Dig should be a much stronger Ground-type move to assist us. So there we have it. Now, it looks like Vibrava wanted to evolve before we headed inside of Reversal Mountain. Uh, I guess maybe that's saying something. Maybe things are about to get... A lot tougher here. I, I don't know. I don't really know what to expect. It's time for us to head inside Reversal Mountain and see what's in store for us. I hope you guys are enjoying your Monday. I definitely am. I have a lot of schoolwork to do, but here in a little bit, I'm going to be heading to my golf class. You know, my friends give me crap for it, but I was at 11 credits for the semester. In order for you to be a full-time student, you have to be at 12. So I was like, you know what? I'm pretty ahead on my credits. I'm going to go ahead and just take a golf class. And uh, it's been a blast since. What are you doing, Bianca? What do you want? The wild Pokemon here are really tough, and I'm having trouble with them. Could you come with me? Oh, sweet. So it's going to be one of those adventures where Bianca tags along with us. I can dig with that. I can... I, I'm a hip with it. I'm, I'm cool with the cool kids. We can, we can roll with that. I think we're actually making our way through Reversal Mountain to end up in the next city, if I am correct. Now, I am not always correct, but when I am... I like being correct, guys. Uh, I, I think. Oh, mother fudge. Are we going to have a doubles battle? All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and switch Pokemon then. I'm going to put... Uh, now let's put Nadar up in front. Let's see what happens. All right. So now that Nadar's up in front, let's go ahead and take on uh, these two people. tough battle there that was actually really really hard i did not think that the pokemon we were going to be going up against here in this mountain were going to be this difficult uh whoa there's actually a lot of exits too i am hoping that i'm headed in the right direction but honestly i'm i'm, I'm not sure if i am guys this is the first time i've ran through here so we'll see how it goes you know I've, i think i've told you guys that i live in an area next to a lot of theme parks and things like that and one cool thing around here that i've been meaning to try for the longest time is uh, a slingshot. I don't know if you guys ever seen videos of it, but I know uh, me and a couple friends were just watching some videos of it and you know, just laughing our heads off uh, of like these people who go on the slingshots and then they get shot up and they make like these hilarious faces and their reactions are just crazy. And I was like, you know what? There's a slingshot near my area. So I've really, really been wanting to try that out lately. I don't know. There's one like really nearby. I just need to figure out someone who would be into the slingshot to take with me. You know what I'm saying? That that's the trouble of it. Hey, wait, we have a battle. And look at we have here, guys. Uh, Nadar is also evolving today. Okay, I guess all of our Pokemon are on that verge of evolving into their next phases. And something about Reversal Mountains really bringing it out from them. All right, I'm actually really excited to see this evolution. And congratulations, guys. Our Nadar evolved into Swana. Now, let's hope it's a good Swana, not one of Skyla Swanas. That was really mean and did some serious work to us, and I never want to see that Pokemon again. All right, let's continue moving on. Uh, I think we're getting really close to where we need to be. Oh, Rodri! Yeah, this is the place. Let's look around a little. What is in this place? Is there a certain something we're looking for here? You want to just get a little something-something going down here in private? What is this place? It feels very strange. Could this be the place where Reversal Mon started from the lair of the Pokemon Heatron? Heatron is a Pokemon with magma-like blood flowing through it. 
All right, so I guess a Heatran used to be in these caves. Uh, it's kind of strange. I feel like we've been here before, uh, but it's been so long uh, since we've explored areas like this that it could be a completely different area for all I know. Uh, it seems like we got a battle coming up. Um, I am not sure who to put up in front. I'm going to go ahead and put Nagini up in front. Let's make something happen. We got ourselves a doubles battle. So I think there's something in the air here in Reversal Mountain, because with that, Nagini is evolving as well. And this is awesome, guys. Our team, something kicked inside of them, and they're all just like, I want to evolve. My turn. Let me do it. I'm first in line. They're next. And with that, our Nagini is coming to its final evolution, guys. So here we have it. Congratulations. Our Nagini evolved into Superior, and that is Nagini's final evolution evolutionary phase so with that guys we have a fully evolved pokemon on our team and i am very excited uh to be adding it to our team uh now it looks like we are headed out of here uh i just need to figure out where exactly it is we're going oh a nugget okay chicken nuggets i love me some chicken nuggets guys that's that's what life is all about just chicken nuggets and uh playing some pokemon that's that's what i love doing with my time i don't know about you oh town is right through here i want to keep looking around a little bit what do you want to do uh yeah we'll see you later enjoy your time hope you find heatran because we are making our way out of reversal mountain with a couple more of all pokemon on our team and it looks like guys we have made it here to undela town so our team has done very great today i think they all need a rest next time guys we will continue our adventure from this point so if you guys have any tips let me know thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next episode Goodbye. Great job, team. Let's go ahead and rest up.